There are six domains in the ID Competency Library. Let's take a quick look at questioning. Questioning has two focal points, challenge identification and question generation. Let's look at challenge identification. So domain uh, questioning, focal point one, competency one, is students can justify the need for a solution by understanding the problem. That's asking why. Why do we need to solve this? What is it and why do we need to solve it? Um, competency two is students can clearly define the challenge in a way that builds a framework for idea generation. So this is like early formulation of the problem. Um, it sets up question generation, but it's before the QFT. It's when they're doing that early, just getting their feet wet and trying to understand what is the problem? How do we identify it and before we ever try to solve it? Um, competency three is students can contextualize the challenge by researching its root cause. To me, that is that preliminary research, um, putting the problem and challenge opportunity in context. The fourth competency in this group is actually writing a problem statement, making sure you've got the challenge opportunity down. Um, this will start to spur the future inquiry that's, God, I can't say that word, inquiry, um, writing a problem statement that's going to take us to the next um, focal point, which is generating questions, question generation, one of our favorites. Um, the first competency in question generation is uh, students can discern what needs to be gained to address the challenge. To me, this is like a no need to know. We've sorted out what we know. We're figuring out what we need to know. Um, some people like this to come before the QFT. Some people like it after. Um, I tend to do it as a really preliminary step, sometimes even before that challenge identification, to figure out what we know and, and just wide open what we don't know. Um, competency 2.2. Is, says students can engage in open-ended process to establish an initial set of questions related to the challenge. This is obviously the question formulation technique. Anytime you use it, you can assess on uh, questioning 2.2. Questioning 2.3, the last competency in this group, is students can use questions in a way that raises awareness and understanding of the people impacted in the challenge. Uh, to me, that's the emphasis is uh, we're questioning to learn more about the people impacted or involved in what we're doing. So that's the questioning domain.